Hey there, my listeners. It is your host here. It is Team Right Right. Listener, how are you doing on this gorgeous Thursday's edition? I am doing super. Let's cut to the cheese. And now we'll discuss for you wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of interesting topics to discuss for you. Yes, you. So sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab something to eat, grab some drink. Now, if you don't want to do nothing like that, that's fine and dandy. Maybe you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts and opinions on a certain matter. And there will be an article down below. Let's freaking roll this. Now, this is for all the wrestling fanatics who loves the old school stuff. Like from the 80s, the eight. Sorry, the 80s, the 90s, and whatever wrestling decade you prefer. Now, the reason I'm bringing that up. Hold on, I gotta find it again. Okay. WWE on the WWE Network will add some rare footage for the 1983. Is that freaking awesome? Okay, the WWE Scratch, I'm sorry. Wrestling DVD Network report that WWE streaming service, the WWE Network, has added the frame last battle of probably screwed up Atlanta event. The full show has run time of nearly two hours. Jesus, two hours? And the features like Jake the Snake Robbers, the Royal Warriors, Bruno San Martino, and Mr. Wrestling 2. Never heard of him. Probably way before my time. Actually, during my time, but I was too young. So you guys could check out the whole entire article. I don't know when I got to post this on um, the W Network. Probably. Oh, they say tonight. Oh, maybe I'm. Sen- oh, yeah, it's tonight. October 18th. Um, I don't know when they're going to post it. Maybe it's there now. I don't know. Let me know if, if it's on the WWE Network already. They usually do these announcements right away. You know, I love WWE Network. You can see some uh, old school footage, current footage, recent pay-per-views, old school pay-per-views. I love the WWE Network. In my opinion, it's way better than buying these D- uh, DVDs for, what, 19 bucks? That is ridiculous. And speaking of DVD, the artwork right now is absolutely awful. Okay, there are. They don't put no work into it. Be you guys, because WWE has the WWE Network. You know what I'm saying? In my opinion, I think the DVDs for WWE will, they will just stop making it. In my opinion, they stop making the Blu-ray because they're not making enough money on it. I think that's just full of crap. They just don't want to make it anymore. So I know none of you think I am telling you guys the truth but uh, this is just my opinion anyway there's an article let me know what you think about the article and um i love the w network like i said before i didn't get it the first day like everyone else did on social media that's kind of silly but i got it a couple of weeks after they launched it and it's been what three years and they still gonna get their internet going what the hell like subscribe leave a comment hit the notification Hit the subscribe, leave a comment to buy an article, and I will be back before you know it. Later. Have a good one. Sorry, I totally messed up here at the end. Hopefully you enjoy this podcast. Subscribe, hit the favorite, hit the notification, and I want some positive feedback about the article. Thank you very much for listening.